Hi everybody, it's Michael Fisher, and today I'm reviewing a table. You better believe it, because it's not just any table, it's a table that charges your smartphone. This is Pocket Now. BlackBerry, Windows Phone, Android Wear, Samsung, Droid. These are just a few of the brand names that have embraced wireless charging, and like it or not, it's a thing. And you should like it, because it's awesome. Yeah, if you want to be pedantic about it, there are still wires involved at some point. And yeah, it's not as fast as a cable can sometimes be, but the convenience of dropping your phone on a pad rather than fiddling with a connector is something that has to be experienced to be fully appreciated. And now, a company called Phone Salesman has made that even easier by building a wireless charger right into a table. This is Furnici, and even discounting all of its wireless wizardry, it's a pretty cool table. It's about a foot and a half high, and it's got a 15-inch diameter top that's spacious enough for a lot of stuff. It's made of lightweight bamboo with a style meant to fit in just about anywhere. A phone salesman says it takes about two minutes to put together. And while the reality might be more like five minutes, we're still talking about four screws and an Allen wrench, which comes included. There's really nothing to it. The wireless charging magic comes from the embedded wood puck charger, which rests in a small recess on the table's underside. A subtle laser-cut ring in the bamboo topside provides a visual cue for where to drop your phone, and once you do, a short beep sounds to let you know you've found the sweet spot. Any device with Qi support will take a charge, but we've tested it with more than 10 devices over the past month, and all of them took power from the Furnici without a problem. So it's simple, elegant, convenient, and oh yes, spill-resistant as well. So where does it come up short? Well, the USB cord is finished in beige to better blend in with the bamboo, but it probably could have been integrated more cleanly than the included clips allow. Also, it doesn't come with a wall adapter, so you've got to use your own. The phone salesman says this was a deliberate decision meant to reduce waste. Speaking of adapters, if your phone isn't Qi compatible, you'll need to pick up an adapter to enable it. And while well, the furniture is a little pricey, even if you get in at the early Panda level on Indiegogo, you're looking at $119 for a single charger table and $179 for the version with two power pucks built in. The company promises that those early Pandas will get their furniture in time for Christmas, though, and the more widely publicized competition from Ikea is priced in the same neighborhood. Phone Salesman sent us a bonus tier package called the Home Collection, which includes two products, the Wood Puck and Chi Stone Plus, alongside the furniture. These work as advertised. The wood puck is basically the same charger as in the table, just independent and much cheaper, while the Qistone Plus is a fully self-contained external battery with wireless charging on both sides. So that means you can use it to charge your phone anywhere at any time, or even charge one phone wirelessly and another one on a cable. And when its 4000 mAh pack is dead, you can drop it on the furniture or any Qi charger to refill it. Combined with a soft touch paint job that makes it super comfortable to hold and really pleasing to behold, it's tough to find much wrong with the Qistone Plus. The wireless charging landscape is no stranger to innovative designs, but Phone Salesman has really taken it up a notch here in terms of the overall aesthetic. They may not be the cheapest products out there, but for those who want to class up their charging, or those in search of a gift for the wireless charging aficionado in their life, the Phone Salesman Home Collection definitely deserves a look. For more wireless charging reviews, check out our other videos here on YouTube, and stay tuned to PocketNow.com for some more coverage of Qi goodies coming in the next week or so. Till next time, this has been Michael Fisher, Captain Two Phones on Twitter. Thanks for watching. We'll see you soon.